Assalamualaikum, Sasikal, Namaste, Kemcho, Majama, Kasakai, Marhaba, welcome to Danish Blockster. Today I'm in my hometown, in my own city, and I want to show you guys some of the places, some of the vendors which are actually going to be at this year Halal Food Festival 2023. What was your experience at the Halal Food Festival in Leicester? You know what? It was amazing. Halal Food Festival is coming to Birmingham. Yes. How excited are you? Very excited, especially if they're there. We're definitely going to be there. Hi, hi, hi. Look at these two. I love it. You know what I like about it? Nice, icy. First of all, very like, strong flavor. Yeah. If you want to taste something like that, guys, at the Halal Food Festival, don't forget 27, 28 May in Birmingham. Welcome to Danish Blockster. So guys, we are back in our hometown, Birmingham. Uh, you must have seen the previous video in Manchester. As you know, Halal Food Festival is landing in Birmingham this year especially. So today I'm in my hometown, in my own city, and I want to show you guys some of the places, some of the vendors which are actually going to be at this year Halal Food Festival 2023. And you know what? I'm quite excited. There's quite a lot of uh, places that are going to be and uh, just to let you guys know the event is going to be at the NEC Exhibition Centre in Birmingham so if you haven't got your tickets yet guys make sure you take your tickets out so today we are in Birmingham City Centre Bullring and the reason why we're here the first place that we're going today is they do some amazing mocktails apparently they were quite not a lot people enjoyed it they were the highlight of uh, let's say if you want to talk about mocktails they were one of the mocktails that a lot of people were talking about it and people enjoyed their different type of mocktail I think they've also added some extra stuff in the menu so you know what let's not delay let's go inside in the bull ring and check this place out all right guys we are in the bull ring on the second floor they've recently uh, basically have landed uh, they've got like a small pop-up you could call it like a store like fruit and ice beverages like I said last year a lot of people enjoyed the mocktails I really want to try the mocktails now just to see how it actually tastes like so we got the owner there as well we're gonna have a chat with the owner and basically just ask him about the experience how was last year halal food festival and what was the main highlight at the halal food festival what were people enjoying what kind of mocktails they were actually enjoying so let's go let's speak to the owner So, Slavic over the UK. Welcome, Salam. You all right? What's the name of over? My name is Mo. Mo. Yeah. And Mohammed for short. Sure. Mohammed for short. Sure. Yeah. Uh, fruit and ice. So, tell us a little bit about fruit and ice. So, fruit and ice. We started in 2017. Uh, we started in the events industry, doing weddings, birthday parties, all types of social events, really. And just last year, we decided to open in the Birmingham Bowling Shopping Centre. Uh, we specialise in hot drinks, cold drinks, fraps, ice coffees, hot drinks. You name it, we've got it all. We've got all the flavors. Mojitos, we specialize in. Uh, mocktails. As well. Quick question: How was your experience at the Halal Food Festival in Leicester? You know That's what? It, it was amazing. Um, I guarantee you, everyone that visited the Leicester one, you know, they enjoyed it. Um, it was. It was quite packed out because I was there. Yeah, well. it was very packed out. It was very packed out. I mean, every time we land there, Alhamdulillah, it's an amazing buzz, and there's so many. Some of the mocktails. 
So, Sarkum, we got some customers here. Sarkum, you okay? Thanks, love. Yeah, you. So, you're having some fruit and ice mocktails? Which one, which, one, which one have you got there? I've got the blueberry with lychee boba. Okay, and what have we got? We've got the pistachio sundae. Sundae, that. Nice. So tell us about, uh, are you enjoying the uh, mocktails? And of course, always come to Birmingham and the first uh, thing in mind, get down to fruit and ice and grab a drink. Fruit and ice and drink. So are you from local or? Yeah, I'm quite local. Quite local. So you do know that Halal Food Festival is coming to Birmingham? Yes. How excited are Very you? Very excited, Very excited. especially if they're there. We're excited. definitely going to be there. Are you definitely going to be there? Yeah. And are you guys looking forward for the uh, fruit and ice? Oh yeah. One of the main reasons I'm going. <laughs> what would you like to say to uh, people out there that are watching this video for well, the Halal sure, Food Festival? First of all, make sure you're at the Halal Food Festival. And if you want great mocktails, you definitely come down. Yeah, thank you very much for that, thank you. So, uh, we've got a berry blue here, which is our secret recipe. Look at that. Okay. Yeah. Is that uh, the secret recipe one? That's yeah? the secret recipe one, yeah. There you go, guys. And this is a strawberry field. Oh, my God. Look at that, guys. <laughs> Look at these two. I love you know what, what I like about it. It's nice, icy, and that's why you guys are called fruit and ice. Fruit isn't and it? Ice, that's right. Especially this is going to be really nice in a nice hot weather. And I'm hoping when the time comes, Halal Food Festival, it's going to be nice and warm. Definitely. So, which one would you recommend to try first? So try the berry blue first, which is a special recipe. Which is just special. Guys, this is yeah. a special recipe. It's called Try Karte. Bismillah. First of all, very like strong flavor out there. Nice, you know, really nice with the yeah. podina as well and everything icy, especially it's icing as well. Have something icy like that if you're you know, sweating around, walking around. Definitely recommend this one. And this one is the strawberry fields. Sorry. So let's try the strawberry field one. 